At a press briefing held on May 23rd, the president of the PAC, Anna Bursar, said she has handed the list of political prisoners presented to her by human rights defenders to the leadership of Azerbaijan. We handed over the list to President Ilham Aliyev and to the Speaker of the Parliament, Oktar Esadev. The list contained the names of people whom we wanted to be released, said Bursar. She welcomed presenting of a consensus list by the civil society. Bursar said that a few weeks ago she had requested Azerbaijan authorities to give her an opportunity to meet with Arab real movement leader Ilgar Mamadov. However, she has not been allowed as yet. Bursar said she will pay another visit to Azerbaijan unless Mamadov is released. According to Bursar, the European Court of Human Rights has adopted a decision on Mamadov's case. She was hopeful that Mamadov will be granted freedom soon. Speaking about the purposes of her visit, Bursar said it was associated with participation in the meetings of PAC Bureau and Standing Committee in Baku. The meetings took place in Baku in connection with Azerbaijan's chairmanship in the Committee of Ministers of the Council of Europe. She welcomed Azerbaijan's ratification of the majority of Council of Europe conventions. Bursar expressed support for Azerbaijan's territorial integrity as previously mentioned in the PAC resolutions. It is our value to support territorial integrity of our organization's member states, she said. Bursar said that there are problems in the areas of human rights, freedom of assembly and expression in Azerbaijan. She said in this respect there is a need to make bigger efforts to fulfill the country's commitments to the Council of Europe. She also condemned the denial of the visa to PAC Vice President René Ruquet, calling it violation of the Paris Protocol on Freedom of Movement of PAC members to participate in the Assembly's events. The reason for denial of visa was Ruquet's visit to occupy territories of Azerbaijan.